In this video, we're going to take a look at using news in trading and how the news features of Journalytics work. Before we do that, let's consider why we need to use news as traders. The most common use for traders is in confirming moves. Let's imagine you're watching a market and it suddenly moves in one direction. It happens all the time. Sometimes it's nothing more than a stop run, an exhaustion event, a range finally broken. Other times it's because news has come into the market. So why do we care? Well, if a move is initiated because of news, then any more technical reasons you might have for entering the market suddenly become invalid. If a market is moving down and it suddenly pops up, you might think it's a good pullback opportunity. If that pop up is caused by the Fed lowering interest rates or production changes from OPEC, then playing that move technically is going to very likely see you in a losing position very quickly. So news is a must. It's your situational awareness. And in journalytics, it looks and sounds like this. U.S. trade deficit widens more than expected in December. So an ear and an eye on the news is a must. It's simple, it's effective, it helps your P&L. Then the scheduled news. Economic announcements that have the potential to move the market, like uh, unemployment numbers, new home sales, car sales, things like that. All events where surprises can hit the market hard. The key with these events is, first of all, not get taken by surprise, which is why Journalytics gives you a five minute warning and a one minute warning before those events occur. So you never forget that an announcement is coming. Now the markets become very erratic just before these events and you don't want to get caught out trading into one. Then the number itself. Well, the key here, if you want to trade the numbers, is to get them first. And with Journalytics, you get the numbers first. So let's see an example. As you can see, we got the numbers just three seconds after the schedule, putting you ahead of other traders reacting to these events. So how do we see just the news we're interested in? There's a number of ways you can, for example, select which news outlets you're interested in. You can also add filters here. And here's some common filters that work for major macroeconomic events. Any filtered text in the headline or the body of the news event will be highlighted. So your eye is drawn directly to the key elements of that news event. If you want to see a full article, just click over here on the right to read it. Journalistics gives you an efficient, trader-oriented, customizable audio and text news feed that will help your trading from day one. If you want to give it a test drive, go to www.journalytics.me today. Thank you.